So how do you like your iPhone so far? Or is it on the way and you're looking for a good case? Well, search no further. Starting with my favorite case for the second year, MacBag. This sleek and soft case is really a tailored suit for your iPhone. It can be installed without any issue, but also undone as easy. All without sacrificing that awesome fit. Better yet, this case comes with one of the best set of magnets in the industry, without sacrificing the ability to charge wirelessly. The material is very soft and therefore won't irritate your pinky finger, where it rests more than you know. It also comes with a clear case and even a grey or blue version. But with the natural titanium, the black one just looks the best. The buttons are very clicky. The only downside would be the small camera bump. But hey, it's a sleek case for a reason. And as far as drop protection goes, it has great front protection. And with the bumpers on each corner, you won't have to worry. This next case is what you call a bulky case. The Rockform Crystal. And if you want the best of the best magnets there are, the type of magnets where you have to go upgrade your gym membership to get them off your fridge, search no further. This hybrid clear case has a regular side and a clear back. The design of this awesome case is what I like more than anything else. The buttons are very clicky, but sadly no button for the action button. And even without any pattern on the case whatsoever, the crystal has one of the best grips out there. Now it goes without saying that if you were to drop this on the pavement, it will probably get damaged. And by that I mean the pavement. This case is made for falling and thus there's pretty much nothing it can't handle. They have one without the clear back too, for if you like that better. Now if grip is your number one priority, make sure you get this next case because it's literally in the name. The Smartish Gripzilla is excellent and still deserves its spot in this video. As you can see, they even make this pistol grip on the sides, which will ensure you won't lose your grip. No matter which button you press, they are all very clicky. The front lip is more than enough, and the aggressive corner bumpers will defend your precious iPhone if you were to lose grip, although highly unlikely. The sides have this grippy pattern, but I would love for them to make the bottom part a little more comfortable, since that has that grippy material too. The case would benefit from a little bigger camera bump too, but at least now you maintain that sleek look. But with the protection of a bulky case. Now as you might have noticed, I've installed a screen protector. This is essential for protecting your screen from repairs or micro scratches. But some screen protectors are not compatible with all cases. So make sure to buy this one from Spiegel. The Gloss TR Easy Fit. It has all the guides to ensure you're doing it right and it's compatible with all of the case mentioned here today. Now moving on to the next case, the UAG Plyo. Now even though I've been recommended in this case for as long as I can remember, I don't want you to get a yellow case. So that's why I was stoked to see that they now have a blacked out version as well. This is a no-brainer, very comfortable to hold with those soft silicon sides, but the protection of a hard case, with the back not being flexible at all. The buttons on the UAG are godlike, and they are very big and easy to press, but also will complement your tacty cool outfit. I only wish they made a button for the action button as well, because right now it's just a cutout. Funny enough, this case seems to be one of the few UAG cases that got a magnet strength upgrade for some reason, but I'm not complaining. It also has these small stands on the back on which it rests while lying on its back, ensuring there is absolutely no wobble going on. The fit is excellent and with that gold slash brownish MagSafe ring, it looks very premium too. For all of you that want a little more class, with the most premium slash high-end case you can get right now, there is this one, the Book Book from 12 South. Yes, this is a bookcase in the form of an old book. Looks awesome, right? And it's also the best bookcase there is. You can take the phone case out for if you don't want to take the whole case with you every time. And its magnet strength is therefore really good. You even got four spots for cards and one with the slide-up see-through spot. And then you can also store cash or something else in between that and the case here. 
The case itself has a leather back with some very precise stitching and on its own it would be enough to recommend. But you can slap this case, which is MagSafe compatible, back into the jacket and now you've got even more protection. Whatever features this case has, like magnetic closing, it just doesn't stack up against the beauty of it. It's very beautiful and I absolutely love what they've done here. Now, if this case doesn't catch the eye, I'm not sure what will. This bright orange with black detail case is called the Nomad Rugged case. I love the bold coloring, which is extended to the power button as well, with a refined pattern. On the other side, three metallic black buttons, which are all very clicky. This case is like the name suggests, a bulky case. But because they tailored the sides and made only the corners swell up, it doesn't feel like one in the hand. The material is also very good and the back does not grease up as much as you would expect it to. MagSafe charging works fine, the magnet strength is more than enough and because of the outward angled corners, I think this will fall on its intended side 99% of the time and thus absorb every fall. Because the edge is higher than the back, it also has increased grip. Especially if you consider there is no added texture. And no fine case would be complete without a cloth inner. To avoid micro scratches on the back. It's been a while since Spiegel made it up to the top 10. But I could not just skip over their Enzo Aramid case. This beauty is strong, thin, but also tiny with those silver details. All buttons including the action button are easy to press. It has good front protection, a metal camera bump and overall refined feel. And for $40 that's not expensive either. The thick front bezel also makes it easy to remove the case once installed. And I love that silver color with the natural titanium. But I'm also certain it will look good whatever iPhone color you have. MagSafe charging works fine, the magnet strength is surprisingly good for what I'm used to with Spigen and the inner of the case feels very premium with a very soft cloth. You can feel no edges whatsoever, thus it's very comfortable to hold all day long. I also like the unique volume button design, which I haven't seen before. And while we're at the subject of Aramid cases, have a look at this beauty from Pitaka. Now I'm only used to their very thin and sleek cases, but I have to admit these thin cases probably won't do much for drop damage. And that's why I'm happy they've introduced their Mag Easy Pro 4. This is all the best of Pitaka, but in a more robust package. That's strong Aramid fiber and TPU details. MagSafe could be better and it's definitely weaker than the regular Mag Easy 4, but that probably has to do with the thickness of the case. Whatever the case, it still works with wireless charging and it won't fall off your car holder or whatever. But it's not amazing either. What is though, is the fact that even though this case is almost a rectangle, the edges are soft and don't push into your hand. I also love their camera bump design and all of the buttons are as clicky as they come. The bigger front bezel also means more protection. And if you like the iPhone 15 but want that square design bag from the 14, this is the case for you. I've saved two awesome cases for last. This case has the best fit of any case by far. It feels very soft. All of the buttons are extremely clicky. It's thick enough for good protection but sleek enough to be normal looking. It has a camera bump but also added protection in between the lenses with each camera lens having their own camera bump too. Very good front bezel and awesome magnet strength. Of course wireless charging is no issue and even features a soft suede inner material. This one is one of the best cases I've ever had but its design is not as flashy as some of the others here today. Best yet, it only cost $19.99. Amazing value for such a good case. This one, with my next final pick, are proof that a good case doesn't have to cost 50 plus. Now, something else that's very cheap or actually free with amazing value is a sub to the channel. And that brings us to the last but definitely not least case for today. Make sure to check out my updated videos too, to stay in the know about all good cases. For your iPhone 15 Pro, but also for your next phone. The Banks MacLab Mist.
the upgraded version from last year's video. The camera bump here looks awesome and will protect your lenses for sure. It's a clear case with a misty type of layer on there, which ensures you won't see those smudges on the back of the case. Very comfortable and a soft silicone on the sides, which are black, so you won't have to worry about yellowing either. This case will look good on any color iPhone except blue if you ask me. But this case has an excellent fit and I like the unique design for the mute button here too. It almost looks like a record button and you could actually program it too. Joking aside, this case looks like it would at least cost 50. But here is the final surprise of the day. It actually costs $18.99. You could buy their new MagSafe battery pack, which is $40.99. And you would still have money in comparison with some other cases. This thing is 10,000 million power and it even has a kickstand. For all products mentioned today, links are in the description, along with their discount code of course, if there is any. So make sure to use those for some extra savings and it helps me grow the channel along with it. Thanks for tuning in today and I hope to see you on my next video.